What's up, guys? It's Chance. Um, and I kind of got some semi good news, semi bad news. Like, it depends on how you take it. Um, I'm not meaning it in a bad way at all. I'm just like, huh, but I like, I'm not doing it to be me. All right, what I'm about to say, I'm doing it, you know, for a reason. Um, as you guys can tell by the title, you guys can probably already guess what I'm doing. And that is, you know, blocking a lot more people. Um, reason for that is actually because of the fact of, as you guys may very well be aware of by now, the situation between me and my now ex, Candle Smith. Um, you know, like I said, I'm not blocking anyone close to me, but I'm going to be blocking those that are friends with her and siding with her. Yo, what up, Eric? What's going on, bro? Hey, yo, after this live stream, Eric, I need you to call me, bro. But uh, the reason why I am blocking a lot more people who do befriend and side with Candle is not to be mean, but it's to, you know, basically protect myself and my family and my friends. And a lot of people don't seem to understand that because this morning I already had to block um, a really good friend of mine named Paul who goes by the, by the nickname Boogeyman. If you guys don't know, he was on the BSR live streams and shit. But unfortunately, due to him siding with her, I unfortunately had to block him. Because honestly, I don't want any connection to her at all whatsoever. Because in befriending her and anybody who is friends with her, that gives her automatic access into my life. And I don't want her having access to my life in any way, shape, or form. Because honestly, she almost ruined my career as a music artist. Um, she almost ruined my life as a regular artist, and she actually almost ruined my life entirely. So, you know, that's why if you are friends with her, block her, or I hate to say it, but you will be blocked if you are friends with her and you do decide to not block her and side with her. As I said, I'm not doing it to be mean. I'm not doing it to be an asshole. I'm doing it to protect my family and those close to me. Because of her, I almost went to jail several different times. Because of her, I've had to watch over my back because of cops. And thankfully, the war is finally over. It's finally ended. I can finally move on. But with her trying to regain access to my life, you know, anybody that befriends her, you will be blocked. Like I said, I'm not doing it to be an asshole. I'm doing it to, you know, protect myself, you know, my friends, and more importantly, my family, as well as my career. But uh, with that being said, guys, I did just wind up dropping this morning, or well, actually yesterday, I don't know if you guys caught it out, but I did just drop a brand new song featuring Cryptic Wisdoms, featuring Crystal, the, the, the Cryptic Wisdom on hooks. So if you guys have not checked it out, man, go check it out on the BSR channel, man. Hit it up. Um, let me know what you guys think. I am going to be doing another version of it, so you guys will be able to check out two different versions. So, there will be, like I said, there will be two different versions of 
the song coming out. Um, the first one just dropped yes. I think it was yesterday. It was either yesterday or the day before. I know I dropped it within like the last two days. I believe it was yesterday. Yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday that I dropped it. If you guys have not checked out the song yet, go do so. If you guys have not checked out the song yet, go do it. I know you guys will love it. I had a lot of fun recording it. So for you guys that want to hear it, it'll be in the comments. Go check it out. Hit it up. You know, smash that thumbs up. And also for those of you that do play GTA 5, I did finally get it literally on Saturday, actually. Um, currently, I am level... I believe I'm like level 18, something like that. Um, I am working my way up to the club status. As far as, you know, being able to buy stuff goes... Um, I am working on buying a nightclub. Um, I'm actually currently working on getting a biker bar so that I can start bringing in some kind of money. But um, I will be actually posting up a video of my 10-car garage that I just bought. Um, I actually just bought it last night, and now I'm just building my cash back up. So while this loads up, um, and, and believe it or not, I actually got my my ten car my ten car garage and actually a good spot because it gives me ease of access to stores um, as well as the paint shop where I can actually you know sell my vehicles if I want to. As a matter of fact, let me show you guys my garage and what I currently have so i will show you guys my current garage and what i have now keep in mind i did not buy any of these i actually found these on the street minus one which i got free for sign up with the for the social club with rockstar games so shout out to rockstar games and the social club but uh here is my current garage over here you got the nice dodge challenger got a beautiful gunmetal gray and white mustang you got a nice alfa romeo This one, I'm not sure what car that is. If you guys could let me know in the comments. One of my personal favorites. Right here, the Ragtop Chevy Bel Air. Got the red with the black Ragtop. You got a Dodge Challenger. Got yeah, another one of those cars. Now, this one right here was the one I got for free. I'm not exactly sure what car this is. But if you guys can post in the comments, got a 370Z sitting right there. And one of my personal favorites. You know you got to have a T-Bird. You got to have a sporty T-Bird sitting up there. And one of my personal favorites, Dodge Charger RT, baby. But that is my current garage on GTA 5 with my dude looking stupid fresh and clean, man, with the finger rolls gloves and the custom watch to match for free, man. He's looking clean, man. He's looking like a boss. But uh, that is my garage on GTA 5 so far. Um, currently I don't think I have any more cash. I think I stuck it, yeah, I stuck it on the bank. I currently have 
75,982. So I'm working my way up to getting the stuff I need. But uh, if you guys do have GTA 5 online, man, hit me up at Retro Gamer Official or OI Retro Gamer OFFIC. Y'all can hit me up on there anytime. Um, like I said, I am working on building up my garage. Um, I actually bought that garage, like I said, last night. Well, early this morning, late last night. So, you know, I am still working on that. And I do have a really cool stunt video I will be posting up on YouTube as well later on, so y'all can be ready for that. But uh, yeah, like I said, you guys, you know, I'm not trying to be mean when I say it. But like I said, if you guys do try to befriend Kendall, you guys might as well, you know, you may as well take me off your friends list because I don't want any connections to her. Because as I said, with you guys having connections to her, that gives her access to me and I don't want her having any kind of access to my life whatsoever, plain and simple. But uh, anyways, guys, I hope you guys do have a good rest of the day. Um, as I said, I know I usually post late at night because I'm usually up, but the reason I've been up so much is because I've actually been super sick these last few weeks. So, like, you know, I've been, you know, just puking up a lot, you know, I'm feeling good one day, feeling shitty the next. So I mean, it's it's been it's been hectic, but overall I am doing okay. I've been like I said, I've just been sleeping mostly, which is why you know I haven't been on as much as you guys usually do. It's because I've been you know sick. I've been sleeping, you know, getting rid of this shit. Plus, it's been too cold to even just get up and do anything. So. But as I said, guys, I do hope that you guys understand why I am beginning to block a lot more people. And, you know, overall, why I'm doing what I'm doing. And I will. Don't worry. Like, I'll get well. This happens to me every year. Like, every time this year, well, around this time of year, mm, you know, I always get sick, always get the flu, so this is nothing new to me. But uh, anyways, guys, I'm going to hop off here, chill, call my brother Eric, hop off some GTA 5, get some more missions done so I can get that money, so I can build shit up. And I will catch you guys later on, man. Peace.